I freaking went over 15 minutes again. I can't believe it. Oh, well, I'm sure YouTube's not going to be that big of a stickler. What's your name? What do you do here? My name is Sephiria. I'm the administrative assistant for the embassies. Busy? You seem to be distracted. Oh, what? The embassies are the hub of all Citadel politics. <laughs> when you represent trillions of citizens, it tends to get a little busy. I'm sure it does. I should be going now. Have a pleasant day. Well, she was nice. All right, Avina, let's talk. Greetings, and welcome to the Presidium. My name is Avina, and I am pleased to be your virtual guide throughout this level of the Citadel space station. And please stop staring at my breasts. It disturbs me. <laughs> so are you a person or a program? I am a fully interactive virtual intelligence. Programmed to provide spontaneous guidance at predetermined locations of interest throughout this level of the Citadel. Huh. I may also be contacted through any of the Presidium VI terminals, should you require assistance. No thanks. I'll pass. I apologize if you found my service unsatisfactory. Please submit any complaints in writing to the Citadel Tourist and Visitor Board. Have a nice day. Sheesh, I didn't say she was unsatisfactory. I was just saying I didn't want to listen to her talk about all the places on the Citadel. Sheesh. Some people are programs are way too sensitive, don't you think? Yeah, they gotta do something about these doors. They take way too long to open. They figure they'd be like on Star Trek, where you push a button, or like on Star Wars, like they just swoosh right out of the way. Instead, these are like way too long. I'm sure it is. Diplomatic stuff. Whoa. Yeah. No idea what that is. Well, actually, I do know what it is, but... Whatever. Thank you. I like somebody's letting air out of like one of those hot air balloons. Commander Shepard, I didn't expect to see you here. Did Ambassador Regina send you? No. I came on my own. I need information. You humans are always so curious, always sticking your fingers into someone else's pie. What? Is that the right expression? No. Uh, never mind. Forget I asked. Was there something you needed, Commander? Let's see, uh, attitude towards humans, specters, CSEC, investigation. Let's do that. Tell me about your investigation into Sarah. Sorry, Commander. I don't make a habit of giving out details about ongoing investigations. Oh, come on. Oh, well. Uh, let's talk about CSEC. Tell me about CSEC. CSEC provides necessary police and security services throughout the Citadel. We're a civilian government agency, though many of our members have had military training. Of course, as the CSEC representative to the council, I spend most of my time liaising between the two. Liaising? Huh. Fancy word. I'll be going now. Goodbye, Commander. Goodbye, Commander. Yeah, got a nice bar in here. This place seems strange. There's no more humans. Uh, there are three right there, there's one right there, there's a human at the bar. I think you need to be a little less stickly. Don't believe the rumors. The Consul would never reveal her secrets. What do you want? Oh, Commander. Is there something I can do for you? Relax, Private. This isn't an inspection. Yes, it is. Right, sorry. What can I do for you, Commander? Let's see, first of all, you can turn around so I can put my boot up your butt. <laughs> Bring him insubordination. What can you tell me about the Asari consort? I, uh, well, she's an Asari who works here as, that is, she helps people with things. Uh -huh. You never want to see her, did you, Fredericks? I, uh, no, I never did. Uh, I couldn't afford it. It costs half a year's credits just to go in and talk to her. Hmm, expensive talk. Can you at least tell me where I can find her? Sure. She's across the bridge from the embassies. Thanks, kid. Have fun. 
Try not to get into too much trouble. I will. Have fun, that is. Hey, Fredericks, uh, I'll give you an entire visit to the consort's pay if you will please kill her. You know, make it look like an accident, like you were, you know, checking your gun and it just accidentally went off in her direction. No? <sighs> Fine. Hello, Commander. Can I get you something? Sure. What have you got? Information, mostly. Would you like to know about some points of interest nearby? Sure. What's going on around here? Well, you found the embassies. Not much going on here. Across the bridge, you'll find the bank, the Emporium, and Shaira's. If you haven't heard of Radio Sunkla. If you need supplies, you can try the markets one level below. For entertainment, I try Flux or Cora's Den. Hmm. What is Shaira's? Shaira. The consort? Uh, she entertains clients who can afford her services. Most of the diplomats and ambassadors have visited her at one time or another. Huh. She's a very powerful woman, but also very respected. Ah, very respected hooker. Very nice. Tell me about Flux and Cora's Den. Well, Flux has gambling and dancing certainly more lively than this place. Cora's Den, on the other hand, well, let's just say it's livelier and deadlier all at the same time. Huh, ah, sounds interesting. Goodbye. So long, Commander. Have a pleasant day. Nasana. We don't have time to talk now. I'm very busy. All right, then. All righty, then. Just getting the lay of the land here. Guess we'll head on over to the uh, Citadel Tower, where we're supposed to be going. So much to explore in this game, though. Do, 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 do. Whoa. Yeah, we'll talk about them later. <laughs> Citadel Rapid Transit. To the Citadel Tower, my good man. Get me there in less than five minutes and get an extra tip. Wait for everything to render here. Saren's hiding something. Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council. Don't be ridiculous. Your investigation is over, Garrus. How did he get here before me? Oh, never mind. Commander Shepard, Garrus Vakari. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Sarah. Wow, you guys really don't do that well, do you? Sounds like you really want to bring him down. I don't trust him. Something about him rubs me the wrong way. But he's a specter. Everything he touches is classified. I can't find it. I think the council's ready for us, Commander. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen to you. I wouldn't hold my breath. Hey, baby. Hmm. Cool fountain. Random Turian. Blah, 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 blah. Do, 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 do. Random human, random solarian, blah 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 blah. Don't be ridiculous. The bonus won't be joining the council for years. I'm not so sure. Yeah, I don't care. Another one of those bug things. Can't remember what the names of them are. Uh, uh, something with a K. The hearing's already started. Come on. Keepers, that's it. Get up there, dog. The Geth attack is a matter of some concern, but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way. The investigation by Citadel Security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow specter and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson, you always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. The one who let the beacon get destroyed. 
Don't think you can intimidate me with those weird lines over the E's and protege, you weird line over E using jerk. I need better comebacks. The mission to Eden Prime was top secret. The only way you could know about the beacon was if you were there. With Nihilus gone, his files passed on to me. I read the Eden Prime report. I was unimpressed. But what can you expect from a human? Oh, shut up, you racist jerk. You know what I've always thought was weird? Even though they say that the testimony of that dock worker was not good enough evidence, since when has this dock worker ever heard of Saren? Don't they keep their specter's name secret? So if he name dropped them, isn't that good enough evidence? Whatever. Saren despises humanity. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. He has no right to say that! That's not his decision! Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. The humans are wasting your time, Counselor. And mine. You arrogant bastard. You can't hide behind the Council forever. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the beacon. Oh boy. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? You can't. I agree. Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? What's the point? You won't see the truth. No. You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. The Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. Yeah, keep smiling, the Drew. Is adjourned. Keep smiling. Don't worry, boys, we'll get him. It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Get for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. Okay, calm down there, buddy. It's just a game. Tell me about this history between you and Saren. I worked with him on a mission a long time ago. Things went bad. Real bad. We shouldn't talk about this here. But I know what he's like. And he has to be stopped. That's right. Just pound your fist into your hand to emphasize the point. What's our next step? As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the Executor. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. I'll talk to him. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. Oh great, make me handle the jerk. Great.